Uh, it's a 2012 Ford Focus Electric. Um, I drive over 30,000 miles a, a year, so you know I needed I needed to do something. Um, I, I could continue to buy gas and you know pay whatever the going rate that day is, or get into something where I use our own technology, our own product at First Energy. It was kind of a neat thing to do. You got to drive fairly conservative to get the range that's stated. Um, but if you've got a full tank and you've only got to use 80% of it, um, it's a really fun car to drive. It's one of the quickest cars I've ever had. We have a very good partnership with the city of Akron. And the city has been very proactive in trying new technologies such as LED lights, and in this case the EVSEs or the, the charging stations. And they actually approached us and asked us, as associated with the Clean Fuels Ohio grant, if they could, or that we, we would be willing to site several units at our facility. And, and we were pleased to be able to accommodate that both for the public and for our employees and to work with the city in that regard. We've uh, worked with First Energy, who's been the, uh, the major user in this parking garage. Every month it's, uh, it's expanding in regards to use. We thought this would be a great opportunity to promote economic development. The chargers that we have here are from Eaton, which is a large company headquartered here in Northeast Ohio. As batteries get to be more improved, the cost comes down, I see hybrid vehicles becoming part of almost every vehicle in the future. And so it's not going to happen overnight, but it's going to be a steady evolution. And uh, again, this is another reason that we can see cars being built here in the United States and Ohio. Ran a lot of numbers, a lot of simulations on how we drive, how it would be driven. Um, my commute is 12 miles each way uh, from home to Akron and then Akron to back, so 24 miles on that. Running the kids was going to be another 40 miles a day maximum. Um, real world range on this car is about 60 to 70 miles a day. So on a single charge, we could basically get all the work done we needed to get done and be saving a lot of money uh, along the way. People believe that they're slow, sluggish, can't get up to speed, things like that. Um, I can merge onto a highway, no issues. Um, it's got a couple different modes to it. One is puts a little more acceleration to the car. Um, that drains your battery a little quicker, but you can get up to speed real fast um, for when you need it. You know, you got the range anxiety stuff. Um, you know, you had to plan your routes, but with the stations here, it makes it a lot, a lot easier to get to really maximize the use of the car for local. It's fun to drive. It's a nice, quiet car. Uh, I was surprised, you know, after driving gasoline-powered cars for so long. Uh, it's got pretty good power. Uh, probably I wouldn't have bought it if it wasn't for the chargers here at work because it allows me to charge at home, drive in here all on electric, and charge up here and get back home again. I wouldn't be able to make the round trip you know, if it wasn't for the chargers here. I just hated going to the gas station. I used to go a couple times a week. 